The City Music Series on today is proudly presented to you by City. This morning for our City Music Series, we are joined by a country superstar who happens to be our good friend. His name is Blake Shelton. I love it. Blake's a busy man. He's out with his 12th studio album today. It's Body Language. And of course, he's a coach on The Voice in its 20th season with the two night finale starting on Monday. Mm -hmm. Hi, Blake. Good morning. Good morning. How's it going? Uh, man, I gotta say this. I gotta say this right off the bat. Say it. I, I was sitting here watching and I was thinking, man, you know, from a distance, Carson is looking young, <laughs> thin. I mean, like, wow, he looks good. And I realize it's the new guy, Tom. It's the new guy. guy. <laughs> I, I gotta text Carson, man. He looks he looks so great this morning. So yeah. he doesn't look good. Who's gonna tell all. him? Yeah. It's not exactly. Carson. No. Um Blake. We miss you. Yeah, you know, we really, it's so fun to have you here, but just not being here and Hoda and I being able to awkwardly flirt with you like <laughs> we normally do, no, well, it's not the same. It's not the same. And, and you know, in this, in this Brady Bunch thing that we got going on <laughs> right here, is, it's kind of creating a, though, like, it's not just a love triangle anymore. It's like <laughs> well, love Chanel's going to no, I'm just coming along Chanel's for the day. Yeah, just She's, for today. Chanel's going to get in on it. Okay, so speaking of love, <laughs> let's talk about your future bride. You, uh, I was reading all over the internet this morning, Blake, that y'all have picked the song that you want to dance to, your first dance. I think we have it queued up, so before you tell us about it, let's just play a little bit of this oldie. <laughs> Okay, uh, wait, what if you leave? What are you OMG? talking about, dude? You know, I'm going to learn my lesson one of these days. First of all, I, 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 I said that when I was on Jimmy Fallon's show, uh -huh. and, and people out there should know I've never given an answer to any question in my life from Jimmy Fallon that wasn't complete bull crap. Oh, that's funny. Like, he, like I mean, why would I be honest with Jimmy Fallon? <laughs> Let's come on. Let's let's be honest. So be honest here. with us. Okay. So what is your first uh, song going to be? The first dance. I don't know. I, well, to be honest, I do. I do love that song. I'm not. I, I love that song. Maybe I can talk her into it. No, no, <laughs> it would I'm be saying fun. This. Uh, we both love the the '80s, you know, soft rock stuff. We're both, you know, that's kind of one of the things that when we started getting to know each other, one of the things that we were shocked about mm -hmm. each other is like, wait a minute. I think she was more shocked. That I was into it, you know. Mm -hmm. She was like, "Wait a minute, what? I thought you listened to like <laughs> band and, and cricket." Well, what about like "Come On Eileen"? <laughs> right, You're, if we're going '80s, oh, there you go. And here's the thing: everybody uh, just just loves you guys. I was just hearing Shania Twain on her podcast saying, "You know, your wedding is the hottest ticket in town. Everyone wants to be there." <laughs> I don't. For, come on, this is, that is ridiculous. I mean, <laughs> nobody likes to go to weddings. That's that's not true. It's weddings are. Maybe I'm just speaking from a dude point of view, but you know, <laughs> unless it's your wedding, you don't really want to go to it, That's my right? Says. What? No, we want to go. <laughs> we want to go to your wedding. Yeah. Hint, hint. So, Blake, let's talk about the other big news in your life, yeah. which we really should have started with, but we we just couldn't believe that about that OMG yeah. song. We had to ask about that. Um, your album. Yes. Can you tell us about your new album? Yeah, I'm so excited about it. You know, I've, I've been kind of pushing back on the idea of releasing an album for a couple of years. And and, uh, and finally, my record company just said, hey, you know, we're we're an actual, we're a record company, so we could use a record <laughs> from you one of these days. <laughs> and, and so we finally, you know, I've been recording for like three years and just trying to, you know, and releasing music along the way, singles, and we put out a hits package and just realize, man, it's time to, to put together an album. You know, fans like to like to dig through them and, and find the album cuts that they love. And and so we're excited, but really proud of it. I don't know that I've ever worked longer on an album than this one. And, and I just feel like it's an album full of, of uh, potential singles. That's kind of how I just approached this because I wasn't even sure we were doing an album. So everything on this were, were, was things that I thought, man, we could release this as a single to radio now and, and just go with it. So... Uh, looking at it from that standpoint, I'm just super proud of the whole project. And what's, you know? the, what's the single that you and Gwen are singing together on? It's uh, Happy Anywhere. Oh, uh, we, this love, one. we love that uh, song. The other song was uh, Nobody But You. That was on the hits package. But uh, Happy Anywhere is actually uh, was actually the first single 
off of this album. Uh, and mm -hmm. then we came with minimum wage and now here, here's the album is out there. So we had a blast making that video. That's when we were in uh, quarantine in, in Oklahoma and, and her brother knew how to work the camera. So <laughs> we were literally out in the cornfield and stuff at, at the, at the ranch and we just used a bunch of old home movie footage. And luckily she films everything <laughs> that we ever do. So do you like it, that? Uh, at, when it's happening, no, but when we need a music video out of nowhere, <laughs> there you go. it's awesome. Yeah, it worked. <laughs> Let me ask you this, Blake, because we're going to actually get to hear a couple performances yeah. pretty soon, including Happy Anywhere. But it makes me laugh because, you know, the whole, like, theory of country music singers, it, it, aren't you supposed to be, like, broken down and depressed <laughs> and, you know, your dog ran away and all that? And you're so happy. You guys are, like, you know, everything's working. Yeah, maybe that's why my career is starting to flop a little bit. Oh, you know, I got to, I've got to, I got to sadden things up a little bit. You're right. You're right. You're supposed to, I'm supposed to, you know, back over my dog and, and uh, have a broken heart, I guess. But, uh. Uh, things are going too good right now, and oh. I can't help but be honest about it. Damn well, it. Well, we're happy about it. All right, well, what do you say we listen to that number one hit? Here is Blake Shelton with Happy Anywhere. I've always been a rolling stone with a reckless streak. The grass never gets too grown Underneath my feet City lights, southern stars No such thing has gone too far I'm running wide open I was born with my feet in motion Since I met you, I swear I could be happy anywhere Any map, the location You're always my destination you're the only thing that I'm chained to I could be happy anywhere I could be happy anywhere with you Yeah, the beauty of the northern lights And my mind is fading Blue sky over till you ride Next to you is kind of overrated The winding road, let it twist My home's where Since I met you, I swear I could be happy anywhere. Any map, the location, you're always my destination. You're the only thing that I'm chained to. I could be happy anywhere. I could be happy anywhere with you. Since I met you, I swear I could be happy anywhere. Any map, the location, you're always my destination. You're the only thing that I'm chained to. I could be happy anywhere. I could be happy anywhere with you. I could be happy anywhere. Well, well, my gosh, thank you. Uh, I'm sad that we didn't have uh, Gwen there for, for that, but uh, that was a shout out to uh, Kara Britz, who I, I stole her years ago from the voice band. Oh, wow. And she's been touring with me now for several years. She does still works on the voice, too, but I claim her as my own. So cool. you step in. Now you sounded good. good. Awesome. Uh, Blake, stick around. We've got another song from you just ahead. But first, this is today on NBC. Oh, we're well, back. We're having such a good time with our friend, uh, Mr. Blake Shelton. Al has joined the table. I love me some hey. Hey. All right. Uh huh. Your new album, Body Language, is out today. We got more music. Yeah, Blake, you did. You recorded another song for us. This is your newest hit. 
All right. We ready for it, guys? It's called minimum wage. Do you want to toss to it for us, Blake? Here he is right now on the Today <laughs> Show. Blake Shelton with minimum wage. The Blake Show. Well done. And you're next. Split an all-star special on our first day In a Waffle House booth Your daddy was crying when he gave you away Cause all those country songs I played They didn't come with a 401k But hey, I had you You can make a six-pack on the carpet Tis like a million-dollar bill You can make a one-bedroom apartment Feel like a house up on a hill You can make my truck out out in the ocean, but all that keeping up with the Joneses just ain't my style. Just give me some ice strung out in the yard, and give me a long chair under the stars. The top of the world's right where you are, cause every time you smile, you can make a six pack on the carpet, tastes like a million dollar bin. You can make a one bedroom apartment feel like a house up on a hill. You can make my truck out Lighters out. That's right. It was awesome. Oh, That's throw, a great song. Throw back a couple of shots of that Smith Works vodka. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho. That's Al's careful good. in there, Al. They're throwing bras around in there. Well, <laughs> listen, it happens with you, Blake. <laughs> And, we can't and, help ourselves. And by the way, Blake, uh, congrats. You got two of the finalists in The Voice mm -hmm. out of five, so maybe you'll do it again. Who knows? Uh, we love you, by the way. The new album, Body Language. I know, Language. because I wrote the script for the show. So <laughs> <I> know. <laughs> All right. Body Language is out now. More performances by Blake. You got one yeah. in the nine, one in the 10 o'clock. Uh, thank so good. you, Blake. Blake, you're the best. Love you guys. Come love back too. soon, okay? We miss you. Very soon. I'll see you very Minimum soon. Minimum wait. Yo, Gwenny, we said hi. We're back in a moment. Oh, this good. is today on NBC. You can make my truck out.